so now let's just quickly add an app bar remove this const from the scaffold widget and we can say app bar app bar title row widget we will have two buttons you can say text button I am their favorite and the other one will be my favorites manx is alignment manx is alignment dot center we want it at the center of our app bar let's add the text button the first one the first text button will be my favorites now the style we will apply according to the condition for example the color so we will say is favorite is favorite and clicked if it is clicked that is if it stands true then in that case the color will be white which will be an active color that is the user has clicked on that otherwise the color will be gray similarly for the font weight if it is true that is the user has clicked on it then the font part in that case will be bold otherwise the font part will be normal else normal the font size will be so this is our first text button let's copy paste this and then we will have the second one which will be I am their favorite and between these two buttons you can add some space or for the designing purposes you can add a text widget inside which you can add uh, two spaces one two three three spaces enough and then this uh, perpendicular sign or you can add dash it is totally up to you which symbol you want to add and then three spaces after that and the color for this will be gray So now when the user click on my favorites button we are going to call the method where we have the keys get favorite list keys similarly the same method we will call when the user click on I am their favorite now there is a condition there is a condition which we have to set before calling these methods and that is is favorites and clicked so my favorites my favorite simply means that the favorites which I as a logged in user sent to other people so these are my favorite that's why to this boolean type variable we give this uh, name is favorite sent that is when the user click on my favorites then in that case the value of this boolean type variable we will make sure that it is set to tr true however in the other one which is I am their favorite here we will make sure that the value of this is set to false and you have to make sure that before calling this method you have to set these values and which you already know now that is if it is true it means my favorites so in that case the favorite sent will be received 
okay the favorite sand keys will be received and otherwise if the its favorite sand click is false it means i am their favorite button the user clicked so the else statement will execute and we have to re uh, retrieve the favorite received okay as you can see and this is all about our these two buttons and one more thing is we have to make sure that before calling this method we must set this uh, we have to clear this similarly when the user click on i am their favorite we have to make sure that we